Alright, what's up everybody? This is Champion here, and I know it's been a while since I made my last video. I lost a lot of interest to Death Frontier. That was until The Wasteland came out. I'm officially outside of it now. I went in there for like, probably 10 to 20 seconds, so before I even go into the details, I'll explain to you some of the rules that Neil posted. You must be level 100 to enter. And Wasteland is hard, really hard, he said, and it is, I mean, you're probably going to need at least a Wraith Cannon or a GAU. If you don't have any of those two weapons, I'll be really shocked if you guys hang in the Wasteland somehow for a while, so good luck. <laughs> and if the game for some reason can't connect you to multiplayer, then your loot and EXP will be reduced. Rate of EXP is roughly 25% higher than other locations. So you can probably do a TS run in Wastelands. I mean, you'll definitely increase the risk of dying. but Or just level up rapidly if you want to. But like I said, you're probably going to need some of the top gear in the game if you want to survive in it. And the loot is much better. You've essentially got a four times greater chance of looting a high-end weapon, armor, or implant. So the loot is significantly higher and I'll be the first to tell you it will be probably nearly it will be nearly impossible for you to loot a body in there. I haven't looted one yet so I don't know. So we'll see if I can even loot one in this video. I'm scared that I might even die in this video. I know there's FPTs, people are calling it Jurassic Park, there's like dinosaur creatures in there. I mean everything's different so anyways um there's also far less junk loot so you shouldn't be getting useless foods, meds, and gear. So I mean I guess that's a good thing. There are far less loot spots so there's uh, by what a couple of my clanmates are telling me, there's probably like one loose spot in each area, maybe two or three, four. It's really not that much. So, if you're looting something, it should be a good loot. Hopefully, I mean, we'll see. But, and you, here's another one. You get ten times more PvP points than you do in the arena. So, I'm guessing if I kill somebody in there, I might because I went in there... If, a minute ago, there's a couple red dots, so if I kill somebody in there, I should get like 500 or something PvP points per kill, which is ridiculous. And if you die in a PvP fight against another player, you won't lose your TS score. However, if you die to a zombie, you will lose your TS score. And that applies everywhere, and not just the wastelands. And there's no friendly fire on Clammy, so if me and someone else i'm in the scarlet sentinels in case anybody didn't know so if me and another ss member of the same hq start shooting at one another we won't take any damage so friendly fire there's no friendly fire on clammates which is definitely a good thing hopefully it implements that in the arena as well anyways uh pvp damage is about 2.5 times lower to help prevent spawn kills in other gangs so if i'm going against somebody in the wastelands i won't take that much damage it will be 2.5 times less damage so you guys shouldn't worry about the people in the wastelands you guys should really focus on the zombies and last but not least, I put it near P13 so that everyone isn't all in the same location anymore. So I'm going to map up real quick. Show you where this at. I'll go to the bunker first. So the bunker is right here. So if you want to go to the wasteland, you have to go one left. Keep going all the way down. Then you'll hit this wall right here. And then you gotta go left all the way where it says battery acid, so right here. Then you gotta keep going down. And then you'll hit another wall right here. And then you gotta keep going left. Left, left, left. And then right here. And I will highly recommend for you guys to go to P13 before you go in Wastelands. Because if you die before you outpost, you will be at the bunker. However, if you outpost inside the Wasteland, then... You, if you die, you'll go back to that outpost. So once you outpost in Wasteland, that's it. You don't have to worry about getting put back to Sacred Non Bunker. So I will still go to P13 anyway, because you guys might not even last two seconds in there. Wish everybody the best of luck. I'm going to go in there now for a little bit. I'm going to show you guys what it's like. And here's the flaming mother body, because I went down there. There's also a couple mothers. I got a crowbar. Wow. But it's up here, so that's probably why. P13 so I'm gonna go in here now I probably won't talk that much I'll probably be focusing a lot so we'll see here's the aggro oh my god 
So as you can see, it's crazy. And you see um, a couple regular zombies. You got these spiky things. Like I said, it looks sort of like Jurassic Park. The tendrils are all black. So I deal a lot of damage. But, and as you can see, I have a Wraith Cannon on. So I haven't done any knockback whatsoever. And you see three people up top. You see EVDA member too. Hash him, he's in here. Well, it's crazy, so... Whew. Apparently there's a flame and black tug, and I don't know where it's at. Hopefully we get the Hollow Prestige boss map up, and we get to know these boss locations. But it's definitely a lot harder. Difficult. I'm a little shaky right now, because this aggro is horrendous right now. Oh my god. But yeah, it's absolutely crazy. And I probably won't even go one down. I don't even know. We'll see. Now, I definitely got all-time TS. I didn't say that in the video. It's like four point something billion. But yeah, I explained to you guys the rules. Any questions or comments, just let me know. Hopefully, I can answer it to the best of my ability. I'm pretty sure I can. I'm pretty. I know like most of this information already, because like I said, I'm already in the wasteland. I read the rules. I read everything. So. <sighs> well, yeah, it's definitely crazy aggro. It's not easy. And as you can see with this area, it sort of looks like a Jurassic Park area, man. There's barely anything. There's like these logs, uh, houses. I mean, it's very empty. There's not really that much. I mean, there's like a lot of room for you to run around in. I mean, that's a good thing, I guess, because so, the aggro is just so rapid. I mean, just wow. I mean, I haven't even got hit yet. I don't even know how, but that's a rage cannon for you. As you can see, like I said, the knockback ain't right there. King Reagan, he died. As you can see, I mean, everyone's going to die. You have to be level 100, uh, level 100 plus to enter, like I said, and it's just going to be very hard to survive. I mean... You really want to have your eyes glued to the screen pretty much when you're in here because if the moment you take your eyes off, I mean, whew. And I don't even see any loose spots. And with that way this aggro is going, you can see what I'm trying to say here. That it's pretty much impossible to loot anything. I mean, I'm actually thinking you should maybe nerf the aggro a little bit. Because, uh, it's impossible to loot. <laughs> so... It's pretty crazy, so I'm pretty sure this is going to be the first Wasteland video that's going to come out. I decided to make it for you guys. I don't know how long I'm going to make this video, to be honest. I'm actually nervous making this video longer because I don't want to die. But, you know, I went down here for you guys, so... Maybe I can hit one down. Oh, there's a loose spot. How am I supposed to get it, though? So, you might be here. Let me, let me see if I can enter one of the houses, forts, whatever. Thirty-eight percent energy, man. I'm already trying to bust some energy. My goodness, man. Yeah, it's nerve-wracking for sure. Just gotta look at it and be like, wow. Imagine if you had like a grenade launcher or a rifle. I mean, you're, even if you had a boomer. I don't see how you can survive this, to be honest with you. Because I'm burning out energy, and I'm not even trying to. And I'm shooting with the Wraith Cannon. So, maybe Neo will nerf the aggro. Who knows? Some dude just said, kill me, please. I mean, I really want to do that. Guess I'll kill feed during my video. <laughs> just kidding. But, yeah, I mean, you're supposed to get 500 points per kill. Maybe I can test him out on my video. I don't know if he's around here somewhere. There's a red dot. Let's see who it is. Is that the nub? Ah, oh, it's EBDA member. Sorry to call you as a nub. Low level player, you know what I mean. I consider everybody good people here. <laughs> but, yeah, it's crazy right now. I'm still healthy normal, thank God. I mean, I wish I could enter in like a building, a door, because I know there's buildings. I haven't even entered one down yet. <sighs> I guess I'll see if I can head down a little bit deeper. 
Oh man, I got exploded on. I'm healthy normal still, so that's good. That's good. Oh, I almost got trapped. It's crazy, man. It's crazy. That's all I can say. I'm a, I'm a crazy son of a bitch, man. All right. It's official. We're in the second area. I know there's an FBT here, so once I see you, I'm out, man. I'm not playing an FBT. There's just no way. I'm not that boss. Oh, almost got smacked. I don't even see a building. I'll see if I can make a left turn real quick. Whew, man. Scary stuff, guys. That's all I can say. So as you can see, all the areas are clear. I wish I can explore a little more for you guys. But it's just too dangerous. So I don't know. I mean, maybe I'll just see if I can fit all around with it. I just want to show you guys the type of zombies you guys will be dealing with if you choose to enter the wasteland. I'm not really sure what everyone's going to do after seeing this video. I'm pretty sure everybody's going to be pretty scared after watching this. I mean, I'm pretty nervous as well. And I really don't get nervous when it comes to different tier. I consider everything's, everything pretty easy. I mean, this is the first time actually saying there's actually a challenge in different tier. Even for me, so... I wish everyone the best of luck. Like I said, any questions or comments, let me know. I don't really know how much damage these zombies do. I'm not willing to test it out because uh, I know if you get hit by like three of these things, you're probably going to be like an injured broken, serious broken. Oh my god, I almost thought I got stuck in like a dead end. Whew. But, thanks for watching everybody. Uh, like, comment, subscribe. I'm here. I'm back. I'll see if I can make more videos at the wasteland for you guys if I go in deeper. I plan on it, but like I said, I gotta explore a little more, get a feel of the area, and we'll see, guys. So, thanks for watching, and good luck, everybody. You're gonna need it. <laughs>